Hello everyone, welcome to the Study Hacks Institute of GIS and Remote Sensing. Today I also will discuss a very important topic, mainly how we can easily monitor the build up height in remote sensing technique in Google Earth Engine platform. So here you can see I already create this map for the build up height in Bangladesh and uh, we can easily uh, get this type of map. Here we can get this type of color, basically this type of purple color, it show the height. Basically, it is a high height we can get from here. So, this is the map about the build up height in Bangladesh. So, in this time, uh, how I can create this map? I also show you this all of those things step by step. First of all, I talk about the data set. So, mainly, uh, what the data set we want to use in here. In this time, here I use this data set. Basically, this data set is that called the global building height. Okay. So, this data set you can get a lot of information from this PDF. You can easily search on the Google, you can easily get that global human settlement layer. Okay, so there's a lot of things you can easily get from here about this data set. So mainly how it will work and how it will be created. Okay, how it will be uh, monitored, the build up height. So all of those things can easily get from here. There's a lot of information they are including in this data set. And basically this data set is mainly for raster data set. Uh, describe the global distribution of building height at resolution of 100 meter okay and this data set mainly it's a combined with the global digital surface model as well as also nasa srtm uh, data set and also used for the global signal 2 image for this data set so in this time here you can see uh, this is the data set we can easily use this data set so basically this data set we can get only for the one band it's called the build height we can easily monitor this uh, build up height using this data set and also monitor so here you can see this is the this is the code about that how i can create this type of map i will show you the one by one step so first of all here you can see this is my uh, data set i just simply import the data set in here so basically this is the unique idea about this data set basically this data set is stored that global building height okay and in this time i simply imported my boundary shape file bangladesh and then i simply clip with my study area and I also choose a specific band about the build height. Okay, basically here you can see this is the build height about this specific band. So just I use it in here. And further I visualize this band also, this type of things I can easily get from here. So in this time it represented the build, building height. Okay, and the resolution mainly 100 pixel. So in this time it calculated that 100 pixel area, mainly 100 meter square pixel area about this uh, what is the condition for the building height it also shows in here in this time here you can see so basically in this time we can get the in dhaka city we can find out the all of uh, high building in the dhaka city so here you can see i can get this type of interface so if you want to check about the height about that simply click on inspector tab and click on this map you can easily find out this data what is the height about that you can see this height is the 21.43 meter and this unit is the meter we can easily convert it into the feet or other any kinds of unit you can easily convert and also you can see the this type of other here you can see then you can easily get the height you can see 8.41 meter as well as also click on here then you can easily get this height about this meet 17.39 uh, meter so in this time this type of color uh cyan color in identify the high height of building okay and this type of black color identify about the low height Okay, suppose click on the black color, so in this time we can get the zero meter. Okay, so there is no building, or if the building is available, then it's not very mass. And in this time, we can simply click on here, then you can easily get this result. You can, so you can get the 9.29 meter. So basically, using this data set, we can easily identify for the build up height. And this data set is available for the globally. So basically, in Dhaka City, we can get the lot of build up region, and it also more high. As well as also you can see the other cities such as also you can see it's the another cities so here you can see it also show the all all of high uh, high building we can get this type of color so suppose you can click on here you can easily get this result about that we can get the 20.32 meter height about this building click on here here you can see you can get the result 16.82 meter and this result mainly show the for a uh, hundred meter square area okay so in this time we show the result for whole country boundary of Bangladesh and we can easily identify where the high height building is available and where the low building is available also you can see this is another we can see here 
it will show about the high building also you can find out in here so you can easily check the what is the height about the building so click on here we can easily get this result 17.45 meter height about this building okay so basically this is the process to monitor the building height using this data set and um, if you want you can easily export this data as the export uh, tip format and further you can also use it to make a map about the building uh, build up height in bangladesh so in this time it show the overall this type of result so basically in dhaka city we find out that high height building as well as also you can see this this is the another also this is the another okay also you can see so this type of uh, color identify about that high building height okay so basically this is the process to create the build up height map you can easily export this type of map as well as if you want to monitor the what is the condition for the land surface temperature or what is the condition about the urbanite island for the high building then you can also monitor so basically using this data set you can also do for the lot of analysis in remote sensing so for that if you want to interest more details about that you can simply contact with me i also guide you about that so in the meantime i also give you an announcement for our upcoming online training program so basically this training program class will be start from that um 15 march this live training will be start from the 15 march and now the registration is the opening okay so if you want you can easily join my live training session and learn the google earth engine platform from beginners to advanced level so basically in this online training program we are also put for first 10 days people will get the 50 percent discount already join our five people so now only five seats are available for the 50 percent discount so if you want to get this 50 percent discount so as soon as possible you can booking your seat and join in our google classroom and so whatsapp group and we are take the class only for the friday and saturday in a week and class time for the ramadan we also change our time period you can also check this time period or if you don't join this live training session don't worry about that you can also get the recorded class and recover this part okay so you can easily get the recorded class also if you miss any live training session don't worry you can get all of those recorded video classes and you can easily practice as if you want to join this online training program you can simply contact in this whatsapp number you can also contact with this email for getting all of this information and also booking your seat so basically in this online training program oh, i will teach all of those things from beginners to advanced level such as if you have no knowledge about the coding such as mainly javascript or python don't worry about that you can learn all of those things from beginners to advanced level as well as we also try to complete all of the special learning method as well as also change detection everything will be covered as well as you can see, uh, see our all of course content mainly first day second day third day i already had all of those things in the video description you can simply check it and further if you have any question you can simply contact with me and when you want to join this online training program you can get this type of benefits such as you can get the course certificate you can get the course all of this material you can get the practice code you can get the recorded class and also get the lifetime teaching support it's very important as a beginner so when you want to learn the google earth engine platform you face a lot of problem so that's why we are also providing the lifetime teaching support so that's why you can easily learn all of those things properly so don't waste your time you can simply contact in this whatsapp number and book your seat and join my live training session. Thank you for watching that. Stay happy, stay safe.